Hi everyone, I'm Susan here for our next Tuesday Shelf Talk. Today I'll be talking about Catherine Collett's The Helpline. This book is in the contemporary Australian fiction genre and we have copies in physical print uh, as well as audiobook on CD, e-book through Belinda Borrow Box and e-audiobook through RB Digital. This is the story of Germaine. She was previously a mathematician with an insurance company but after an unfortunate incident she left. After being jobless for quite some time, she's picked up a job with the local council on their senior citizen community helpline. Um, Jermaine's a bit of an odd duck. She doesn't really understand people and she thinks that she doesn't need or want people. She also has somewhat overinflated ideas of her own importance and the importance of her own perspective on the world. Um, but we can sympathise with her and enjoy her personal growth um, in the story as she comes to recognise where her own true value does lie. Uh, the cast of other characters are very relatable and, and recognisable. Um, the story is set in Australia in a small town council, which I enjoyed working in a council. Um, and oh, some of the detail about the level of influence that the mayor has over the day-to-day -day administrative running of the council was inaccurate, but you know you can still enjoy it and overlook that. Um, the story itself is light and fast-paced, and there's plenty of humorous incidents and also you know genuine care. Um, that happens within the story. If you enjoy books about quirky characters like A Man Called Oove, uh, Eleanor Oliphant is completely fine, The Rosie Project or Edition by Tony Jordan, um, then you'll probably enjoy this one too. So that's The Helpline by Catherine Collett. Thanks for listening and we'll see you again next week for another Tuesday Shelf Talk. Bye!